。大家好，欢迎收看 The Young Talents 向大师致敬访谈系列影片。我是傅一涵，我目前定居于芬兰，担任 f u l Music Studio 艺术总监。我们致力于推广台湾与芬兰的文化与艺术交流。在学习艺术领域的过程当中，我们常常会向大师请益，我们也可以称之为偶像。那我们在学习不同国家的艺术的过程当中，我们常常会遇到许多的瓶颈，可能是文化上的差异，也可能是语言所造成的隔阂。让我们来听听看不同的艺术家在对于学习不同文化与不同国家的呃艺术领域当中遇到哪些有趣的事情呢 ？How do you feel when you? When you learn Taiwanese,、mm, our ear is so used to our mother tongue. It's really hard to hear other sounds. It's really、mm. hard to separate other sounds. For example, in Chinese and Taiwanese, there are certain vowels which clearly are different to you,、mm -hmm. but I just can't really catch the, the difference. Being a singer, also like hearing some of the. Taiwanese and Chinese sounds like they almost sound like sounds in French or sounds in Finnish. It's, it's so cool. It's it's difficult because there's not as much context、mm -hmm. for for Chinese and Taiwanese as there is for something like French. I remember when I studied opera, which normally is Italian or German or sometimes French. French. So for me, it's a challenge as well to learn the opera, and I think now it's the revenge. <laughs> So that's why we have this project. It's really interesting, and it's really, really good for the brain and for the muscles also to、mm -hmm. learn to how to form new. Yeah, I think that's the same challenge、things. when I studied the Western、mm, language. Yeah. yeah. For instance, like the double consonant or the double vowel. Yeah. For me, it's a little bit tricky in the、yeah. beginning、yeah. to realize <laughs> it. Yes. Yeah, and for example, the first time you were trying to give me a language. Coaching lesson、mm -hmm. uh, online.、So、I'm not used to tones, and you're trying to teach me the the moon song. Yes, I would just try to copy the the phonemes,、mm -hmm. and you're like, no, no, no. It's like this. It's like this. I'm telling you, what? Like, am I having the wrong consonant? <laughs> <laughs> and it took me like like two lessons later. I realized that it's it's actually the tone yeah. <laughs> yeah. that makes the difference to you. <laughs> And because in the same pronunciation, if you have different tone,、mm. it means might totally different. Yeah, yeah. Especially when the same tone and the same intonation, it already can mean different if you read it in different way. So it's really complicated but beautiful language. Can、yes. you give us、uh, an example? How would you say like bubble tea in Taiwanese? Zhenzhu <laughs> Nai Cha. Zhenzhu Nai Cha. Zhenzhu Nai. That there was usually no no moon. In New Year.、Okay. So the New Year Day normally is no moon. Okay. If we would happen to have a song called "The Moon Represents My Heart," then during New Year, I don't have a heart. <laughs> Or it's like if the moon represents my heart and I always love you, then sometimes the moon is there. It's hidden. Like it's always yeah, no, there,、right. but you don't always yeah, see it. Yeah, you're right. You're right. It's yeah. It's, you don't always see it, but it is. It is there. Supposedly, always there. <laughs> it always comes back. What makes home? What makes home? What is home? You feel the life style is what you related. Yeah.、Mm -hmm. Or you feel the life style is what you would like to achieve it.、Mm -hmm. Yeah. You feel stable. Or you feel.、Mm, you feel like home. I think to me, home is knowing where I come from, knowing who my ancestors are, knowing who my family is, and, and it doesn't matter if I'm close to them or far away from them. If, if I know who I am、yeah. and who are my people, then I'm home.、Mm -hmm. 希望您还喜欢今天的访谈内容，谢谢您的观赏，我是傅一涵，我们下次再见。